Yo, we stuck right here, dude. What the fuck? We stuck on the wall. Who's next to me? What? That's you, son. I see you. I'm stuck. <laughs> Can't move, dude. You stuck between two little poles. <laughs> Try to jump straight up. I can't. You stuck between two little poles. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Look at this retail. You lucky Willie's over here helping you because you all stuck. <laughs> <laughs> you ride the pole, man. Oh, shit. Oh. What is going on people? This is your boy, the number one stunner. Welcome back. I said welcome back. It's been a while since I've hit off a commentary, so I figure it's about time to bring one out. Me, I like to drop a lot of live gameplays because the people I play with, some funny motherfuckers and it's a lot of funny moments to go on, so I like to bring that to y'all, you know, for entertainment. But I also realized that I hadn't done a commentary in a while and it's some things on my mind needs to come on out but this gameplay right here I think I went 53 and 8 I think with the bow inferno yep you heard me right the bow inferno finally got that bitch in a supply drop so now the only thing I'm looking forward to is the obsidian steed and maybe the AK-12 RIP but this inferno I gotta admit it's a beast once you get used to it high ass fire rate and it will slay some people down come on now what I want to talk to you today about is the topic is let it go let things go some people don't know how to let things go they are too worried about what other people are doing like okay this gameplay right here I got with my homeboy kills on cuz apparently if you run with a whole full party then you're not good at the game because you have a party full of friends we run almost full parties because we have a good time and it's just us fellas having fun it's not about posting DNA's or fucking unstoppables or flawless if we do get one then hey you know we happy because we never claim to be gods at the game if I want to post a 31 flawless, I'll post a 31 flawless, but I never claim to be a god at the game, like some people say I am. I Apparently, I have beef with people I never even knew I had beef with. And, I, and the funny thing is, some of these cats, we have the same friends, so of course I'm going to know about it. But to me, it's ridiculous. I mean, you got to change. You got to let it go. Quit worrying about other people's YouTube channel or what they putting on there because this is my canvas. I'll paint what I want to on it. That's what it all boils down to for sure. Same way with your YouTube. It's yours. Put what you want up. Post what makes you happy. But don't worry about what say I'm posting or what he's posting or what she's posting. Who gives a shit? Because I'm going to tell you what. You know what you look like? You're actually looking like you might be a little jealous. What is, I mean, is it jealous because we're having a good time, just having fun? Because when you're worried about what other people are posting on their channel so much, so bad, you know what you look like? I'm going to give you a little hint. This is what you look like right here. That's right, butt hurt. You're looking very fucking butthurt. And I don't understand why. I really don't. We play just for fun. The people I play with, we have a good time. We laugh. We joke. It is what it is. And yet, some of the people that are still just talking shit and can't let things go and let bygones be bygones, I don't understand it. You know, I used to look up to some of them. Because I used to think, yeah, man, these cats are really good at the game. Damn, they're beast. But me? I've never claimed to be a beast. But for some reason, some people think that I am claiming to be a beast. I don't get it. 
So the whole time that y'all sitting over there, you know, being butthurt about what this person's doing or that person or what I'm doing or whatever, you know, we over here sitting there looking like we looking like this right here. Come on. That's right. We're laughing. Just straight laughing at your ass because we don't give a fuck. We're playing the game to have fun. On this YouTube thing, I've met some really cool people. I've met some people I thought were cool. But the ones that I've run with now, we have a damn good time, laugh, joke. I mean, it, it's it's all fun. You know. But some people, you, you got to learn how to let things go, man. Just do your thing. Worry about what you doing. Don't worry about nobody else, man. Because all of this drama and hate and stuff, it, it's not trolling. You really are pissed off at people. It's what you are, and, and it don't make no sense. I don't understand why I be so butthurt about it. You know, you got to change, man. And regardless of whether you know it or not, people change every day. Whether you realize you're changing or not, you're, you're changing. And you got to get that hate out of your heart. Me, I only have hate for one person. And that's when this whole thing changed for me was one event and that person I'll never forget that's for sure but that's just me you can you know I won't forgive and I won't forget but other than that the rest of this shit is so petty that we don't care we've moved on we do our own thing and I don't understand why other people can't do that just move on do your own thing be you man don't worry about what other people's putting on their channels we're not claiming to be gods we're not claiming to be better than anybody else at the game we're just playing having a good time now, that's just some things that i feel like i needed to get off my chest so hopefully you know this video is coming on to an end so hopefully if you enjoyed it you remember to rate like Comment, subscribe, teabag, donkey punch, finger pop your asshole, tongue punch a fart box, titty slap the like button, you know man, whatever floats your boat. And I'm sure I'll get a lot of these haters out here that'll pull that thing out that ass and leave a brown stain on that dislike button, but I don't give two fucks. I am your boy, the number one stunner, and I am out.